you know what's what's nice about the, the PSL this season is that you were also able to travel to different parts of the country and play there. Uh, there in Vigan, it was was one of the stops. Talk about what, what it was like, especially with the fans uh, coming to, to greet the the PSL players in the provinces in, uh, of the Philippines. Yeah, it was really nice to go to Vigan. It's really beautiful there, and the fans are like they're like so loving and like they show all the support like we had like a little tour around the city like waving to them and everybody like we're stopping what they're doing like to greet us so it was awesome like to see the like in the different part of like the, the country people were like watching volleyball and like watching the PSL and they want to like see us so it was a pretty good like experience to go around and like not just in the do you see yourself staying here in the Philippines to play volleyball? Yeah, I do. I, I've been saying that like I would love to stay here and if someone like offers me a job. <laughs> Calling <laughs> Patron! <laughs> yeah, but like I'm in love with the country so like I would, I, I don't think that uh, my experience here is finished after the PSL so I hope, hopefully I will come back next year and like stay for a for more months than only like three months yeah. here, so yeah, hopefully like I'll come back. <laughs> Speaking of which, um, Patron, the uh, Blaze Tigers, you guys will be uh, playing in Vietnam uh, for the club uh, around, around is, it, is it Southeast Asia or, or Asia, uh, the, the championships? I'm not sure yet, but I think it's like Asian, yeah, Asian. So the Asian club championships, yeah, yeah. Uh, so that means from different parts, but basically you're representing the Philippines. Yeah. With the Philippine Super League, the champions uh, will head on to Vietnam and play in that competition. Since you're, uh, since you are one of those players who have had experience playing in different parts of the world, have you spoken to your teammates about what to expect uh, come? Because this is an international competition already. Yeah. Not yet, because there's like nothing like. I talked to Patron that like I'll be av available to come, but like we haven't like at a meeting like to make sure that I'm coming back and after the championship we didn't talk about like volleyball with the girls. Yeah, you're still celebrating. <laughs> yeah. so, <laughs> so maybe it's something that will work and yeah it's going to be totally different. It's going to be like a great uh, experience like playing like international and the girls getting like international experience so it's, yeah we have to talk so yeah. like yeah. All right, well, is there anything that you want to say to the fans of Petron? Of course, it's a growing fan base here in the Philippines, and the fact that so many people came out to watch you guys play and continue to support you, I mean, you have to have a message for them. She was getting messages when she was still in Brazil. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> there you go. Oh, there you go. Yeah, I, I want to thank everybody. It's been amazing, and one of the reasons, the reasons for me to love the Philippines is because of the fans. Uh, they're being amazing. They're being supportive, and they gave me they gave me like so many presents, and they also like they take care of me. So I want to thank everybody to support Patron and me and all my other teammates. So thank you, and I promise I will come back. What were the presents? <laughs> well, like I got I kind of got like a lot of things. I got like dried mangoes. I got like a bracelet, like really fancy one. Wow. wow. Yeah. We never got that. We don't get those things. Thank you, Erica. Thank you, Erica. Congratulations. Congratulations. We'll see you soon. We'll see you soon. Sometime next year. Thank you.